okay let's go back to our project to our HTML and um, we will need a button off or turn off okay then give it an ID of off then uh, the same thing we will have another button which is turn on in this case and give it an ID of on we will uh, use this ID next on our just uh, next on, on our JavaScript then we will have an image image source of let's make it uh, off by default GIF so this is our image but let's just uh, add some styling so using some uh, internal styling CSS let's select our body give it uh, a height of 100 bh a display of flex justify content uh, center and align item center so it's in the center um, okay um, then just go and select every the um, oh first give this image an id then maybe move the alt element uh, the alt attribute for now and give it image now we will so select using constants now don't get confused with what variables really are they just con containers so uh, in the next couple of tutorials we will see what uh, variables are functions are but for now just um, follow along so const let's say off equal to document dot get element by id and our id is off then I'll just copy this paste it three times then on then the next one is images uh, image I guess uh, yeah image the ID is image then on now when our off is clicked we can uh, even do this in a simpler way but anyways you can do it this way too on click uh, add some text uh, add some something to our image dot we'll just change the source to on dot gif oh this is just off so off um, then just copy everything paste then when on is clicked change it to on.gif now we can see on and off on and off so this is just the application of javascript on html um, I've, uh, I've shown you how you can even manipulate your css or your styles so in the next tutorials uh, we will see more about JavaScript, so thank you.